Hey guys, today's tutorial is going to be one that is incredibly easy. It is a look that I saw on Cara Delevingne and I just thought it was really simple but I love the color combination so that is what I am recreating today. So I am just applying foundation and I'm actually going to do my entire face first, or not the entire face, but just my foundation and concealer. Normally I do foundation and then go straight to the eyes, but since there's not a lot of eyeshadow going on, I figured I would do my foundation and concealer. So I'm just, um, do, I just set my concealer, that's what the word I was looking for, and now I'm going to fill in my brows. I'm filling them in a little bit, um, thicker than I would normally because, um, Kara is known for her super bold and thick brows. So I'm just filling mine in using my normal dip brow pomade and then setting them with a gel. So for the eyeshadow, it is super simple. I am just taking um, a tone colored eyeshadow and applying that all over my lid up to my brow bone. And then I took the color Merlot from the Lorac Pro or Mega Pro palette and I just dipped it in some eye drops or I dipped my brush in some eye drops and then mixed the shadow to create a nice little Merlot colored winged liner. And then this is the only other shadow that we're gonna be using. It's just the color stone from the palette and I'm just focusing this on the outer portion of the eye. Then I'm taking the same color on a pencil brush and smudging it into my lower lash line. I'm also blending out the wing a bit because you can't really see the edge of the wing. It's not a super defined wing, so I just wanted to blend that out a tad. And then I'm just going in with a little bit more stone shadow. And that's the eyeshadow complete. I just think it is super pretty, but um, has that little pop of unexpected um, purple Merlot color, so I love that. Um, I'm skipping bronzer and just applying some cream blush to the apples of my cheeks. This one is from Maybelline, so it's a very inexpensive option. And then I'm taking a liquid highlighter from Buxom, and I chose this one because I didn't really see too much um, highlighter on her face, but I did want to add a little pop. And then to finish off the lips, we're just going to go with the simple gloss. So that is the entire look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.